Meet Sky October 2023 events. As in years past, October is meteor season. There are seven meteor showers that reach peak activity during the month. There are also chances to see asteroids, dwarf planets, and other planets in our solar system too. Be sure to mark your calendar for Ring of Fire Solar Eclipse on October 14th and the peak of the Orionids meteor shower on October 21st. October 5, peak of the Camelopardalid meteor shower. I said the October night sky would be full of meteors, and the first week of the month underscores my point. As constellations go, Camelopardalis is one of the more overlooked ones in the sky. Camelopardalis is a large constellation that represents a giraffe and sits between Ursa Major and Cassiopeia. Unfortunately, the October camelopardids aren't the most active and only peak at a maximum zenithal hourly rate of 5 meteors per hour. October 9, peak of the Draconid meteor shower radiating from the constellation Draco, the dragon, this northern hemisphere constellation, will be spotted near the bright star of Vega. In 2023, the meteor shower is expected to peak around midnight on October 9th overnight from the 8th to 9th. This is prime stargazing time despite the full moon that night. So the Drakenkins are exceptionally unreliable when it comes to predicting meteor activity. Most years it is a minor shower. In some years it exceeds the superactive Persides and Geminids, and in 2011 astronomers reported over 600 meteors per hour during the peak. October 10, peak of the Southern Taurid meteor shower. Despite their name, the southern torrid meteor shower is actually visible in the northern hemisphere. Instead, the southern torrids are so named due to a split in the torrids meteor shower caused by gravitational perturbations, especially from Jupiter, that have resulted in two different branches of the meteor. October 11, peak of the Diorigid meteor shower. Going for bingo on the meteor showers this month. Here's another chance to see more. The Diorigid meteor shower will peak on the night of October 11th. We'll be honest though, Delta Origids aren't the most stimulating, with a maximum HR of 2 per hour. Just keep an eye out for them if you happen to be out stargazing this night anyway. October 14, Annular Solar Eclipse. During an annular solar eclipse, the moon appears slightly smaller than the sun so it can't block the entire disk. The result is a beautiful ring of fire. Here's everything you need to know about this rare event. To the Saturday Octi. 14, 2023, annular solar eclipse will cross North, Central, and South America. It will be visible in parts of the United States, Mexico, and many countries in South and Central America. In the U.S., the annular solar eclipse begins in Oregon at 9.13 a.m. PDT and ends in Texas at 12.3 p.m. CD. The path of the annular solar eclipse next visits Mexico and Central America. Passing over Guatemala, Belize, Honduras, Nicaragua, and Panama. The annular eclipse crosses into South America in Colombia. It passes over northern Brazil before ending at sunset in the Atlantic Ocean, roughly 11 years after the same type of solar eclipse crossed the U.S. southwest on May 20, 2012. This one will be visible from a similar region, crossing eight U.S. states from Oregon to Texas. October 21 peak of the Orionid meteor shower. The greatest night sky event in October is undoubtedly the Orionid's meteor shower, which is expected to peak on October 21st this year. While the meteor shower occurs from October 16th to 30th, there may be up to 21 meteors per hour during the showers peakly in the early morning hours of the 21st. The Orionids are easy to spot since they originate from a point in the night sky near the highly recognizable constellation Orion. Look for Orion in the eastern sky if you're trying to see this meteor shower. In 2023, the constellation Orion should be visible throughout the night, from about 10.42 p.m. ends word until sunrise. Any time in that window will be good for trying to spot Orionid meteors. October 28, Partial Lunar Eclipse after the annular solar eclipse on October 14th, one would naturally expect a lunar eclipse to follow. And one would be right. 
On the night of October 28th, there will be a partial lunar eclipse visible from Europe, Africa, and Asia, as well as part of Australia. Admittedly, partial lunar eclipses aren't as thrilling as their blood moon counterparts, Oltea lunar eclipses. Only part of the moon will be obscured by the Earth's umbra, so only part will turn red. Nevertheless, if you live in the region where this lunar eclipse will be visible and the skies are clear, head out in the evening, night, or early morning hours to spot the moon in an unusual hue. Hope you will enjoy the October 2023 night sky events. If you enjoyed watching the video, do give us a like. Also, share the same with astronomy lovers. And subscribe to our channel, Secrets of Space, for astronomy updates. Thank you for watching.